Well, good morning and welcome to Sunday morning at our house. So, the clocks went back. Yes, an extra an hour. Yay, I love it. I much prefer to get up an hour later than an hour earlier, definitely. Ibi's uh, working at the desk here. I'm about to make him some pancakes for a special treaty breakfast. We've really been living it large, haven't we? Eating fine food and playing tunes together every day and yeah. We haven't had a walk because the weather's been so bad, but the sun's actually just come out for the first time. Oh, I didn't wash up. What a pain. Well, I'm going to shove it to one side and make pancakes and deal with it after IB's gone home later. That's the remains of our halloumi curry we had last night. Could perhaps have that for lunch, maybe. IB is washing up for me. It's a marvellous treat. I'm uh, whizzing up the pancake batter. I can smell this. There's too much oil in there, but I've done it now, so... Right, the first pancake's always a dud, isn't it? Okay. Here's Ibe's pancake, I reckon that's done myself. In Welsh that is a krempog, by the way. And he's going to have some golden syrup. Oh, maple flavoured golden syrup. Got from one of the cheapy shops. Oh gosh, it's like smoking, I have to turn that down. Ah, I'm going to set my fire alarm off again. Do you want to open the door, Ivy? How was the first pancake? Oh, oh. Right. lovely. I'm going to try the second pancake. Ivy's going to make coffee now. We've turned the stove off and we're going to make coffee. Possibly have a second. Uh, what was it? Creme of? Crempog. Oh, Crempog. Oh. That's Welsh for pancake. Delightful. Crempog. Crempog heaven. Mine's not quite cooked actually. A little bit eggy. Oh, this is nice, isn't it? I've eaten my Crempog, my pancake, and IB is having a nice little whistle to himself in the kitchen and making me delicious coffee to wash the pancakes down with. Oh, this is the life. And he's done half me washing up as well. He's intending to finish it. When you mentioned half the washing up. Well, I intercepted you with a pancake on a plate, so you had to abandon the mission. Yeah, okay. And back on the case. Yeah. Look, the Welsh Government news. Just in, no U-turn on banning sale of non-essential items in supermarkets. And also, second fire break in Wales, likely in January or February, says Minister. Oh. People told to prepare to come in and out of lockdowns until a vaccine is found. Wow. Look, washing up's nearly all done. This pancake is nearly done. It's bubbling up a bit. And the coffee's done. I'm just pouring it. And I was just pouring it. I thought, oh, I should probably film this. Oh, dribble, dribble. I'm being impatient. I'm rushing because I've got a feeling that pancake's burning underneath. <laughs> oh, it's not very much in there. Maybe it wasn't done. I might put that back on, see if any more comes out. Oh, bless you. <laughs> That's next door, they're having a bath put in. Look at that, and I haven't even had to lift a finger to do it. That's amazing. I'm just going to pop a bit of milk in my coffee and sit down and enjoy it with Ivy. <laughs> We're getting some very entertaining noises coming from next door. Aren't we, ears? <laughs> it sounds like... Oh, I can't say trumping, can I? Was that offensive these days? Depends if you're a Republican or a Democrat. In British English, trump means to fart, but it's not quite as rude as fart. Anyway, this is what it sounds like. <laughs> it's actually 20 to 12 now, I'm still in my pyjamas. Uh, but I'm going to get dressed now and IB, invisible boyfriend, and I are going to go down in the cellar again and probably have another hour of tunes before he heads off back to IB land. <laughs> the noises have just gone even crazier coming from next door. Oh, I stopped now. He was doing it, honest. I think they're having a new bathroom put in, you see. I'm gonna quickly get dressed now anyway. Izzy's checking all her social media because she only just got up. <laughs> That's what she likes to do when she's got up and uh, IB's doing some work. Right, I'll just quickly transform myself. I've got a fiddle player in my cellar. I've got my bees down there. And Izzy is up in her room singing 
I've lost my handicam, I can't find it, it must be upstairs. Uh, anyway, she's up there doing her singing practice and I've been playing with IB down in the cellar and I just nipped out for the loo, but I thought I'd just tell you what's happening and I'm gonna go back down and practice again now with him. It is now 1.20, we finished practicing, we played for an hour doing more traditional jigs and reels, Irish ones, in the cellar. Isabel, I think she's still singing, doing singing practice on her own in her bedroom. IB has just had a munch on some leftover cold toad in the hole. There's the other bit in there and I tell you what, it makes lovely lunchbox food. I mean obviously there's a uh, vegetarian sausage in there. I don't know about the bacterial growth on meat ones compared to the veggie ones but Honestly, that's uh, if you make a batch for yourself and then put what you don't eat in the fridge, you could have it next day in your packed lunch, really nice cut into squares like that, and just eaten cold. I am microwaving myself a portion of the leftover halloumi curry with lentils. And Isabel hasn't that long ago had a pancake. She made herself the most enormous pancake. It was thick and very substantial, so that should keep her going for a bit. IB needs to get home. He runs his business from home and he has to sort stuff out for the start of the next working week so he has to get on and uh, yeah I'm gonna sit down eat my lunch watch a vlog and then I'm gonna edit the vlog that I've got to put up tonight that you will have already seen because I've did a rough cut and finished that about 11 o'clock last night but I haven't finished it off so I didn't want to eat up all the time that I had with IB this weekend so I've done less editing so I'm gonna do that after he goes now that's my plan <laughs> IB's just laughing to himself because he's been attempting accents and failing. Uh, this is my lunch, my curry, it smells really nice, I'm looking forward to that, might put some lime pickle on it maybe. Mm. Oh no, it's doing that thing again, I obviously didn't quite tighten it enough. Damn, it's going all over the stove, look. It is doing, uh, so it's, I'm just going to leave it to finish, but uh, I'll have to clean it all again, I only just did it. Then I'm going to sit down and work on the vlog, I had my dinner by the way, it was very nice. Isabel is up in Isabel's room and she is working on her college work at the moment she's very busy I think it's going to keep her busy pretty much all day she says she does want to do some painting later that's done excellent so I'm sitting here at my desk it's 2 30 in the afternoon I'm just working on the vlog and it is so dark so dark <laughs> hang on let me just show you how dark it is so I didn't have the lights on it's it's literally that dark <laughs> it's crazy and this camera is good in low light as well I'm now updating the firmware on my GoPro Hero 9 Black. It's been a bit glitchy, guys. It's been a bit glitchy. And I'm really hoping that this is going to sort it out. It's been doing quite a few annoying things. Number one is the first time you use it, like in a recording session, it crackles on the audio. And also, sometimes it just randomly won't switch off. And sometimes it just randomly won't switch on. So I am really hoping that this is gonna sort it out otherwise i'd better get in touch with gopro i don't have a very good history with cameras <laughs> i'm hoping to go for a walk shortly as soon as this is done actually because it's already five to four and of course it would have been five to five except the clocks have gone back by one hour and i know that there's not an awful lot of daylight left in the day and i haven't been out yet today it's probably raining but i'll just take an umbrella and head out anyway <laughs> i'm having a sneaky snack before i go out on my walk I'm terrible for getting low blood sugar when I'm out walking. Ooh, ooh, goody, yay, that says it's done. Anyway, I just went to the kitchen. I thought I fancy a bit of that Swiss roll I bought for Halloween. Well, early Halloween bash that Izzy had with her friends. Only to find she's eaten the whole lot. But she hasn't eaten her party rings that she bought, so fair game, I thought. I'll have a little um, nibble of these. Very crunchy. Mmm. I'm just getting ready to go out. I need to put some proper socks on because I live in my fluffy bed socks at the moment. Since the beginning of the lockdown in March, I've barely been in normal socks other than my little brief trips out. Okay, so I've got a cold can of pop as my super treat when I go out walking. Mask, just in case I want to go in a shop. I don't think I will. Wallet, just in case I get an urge. I probably won't because obviously we're in lockdown. It's only really meant to be for essential things my sanitizer, the GoPro on this mini tripod because I want something small for shoving in my bag you see and that's it. Actually I'm going to want an umbrella because it has mostly been raining today. I still don't know where my one is but I'm going to pinch his ease. Uh, hopefully I don't break it. I wonder if umbrellas are considered essential items here in Wales. Hopefully they are because 
as a non-driver an umbrella is essential to me at least because you get wet otherwise when you're heading off walking to the train or the bus and obviously at the moment we're trying to avoid the trains and the buses well i've just updated the firmware on this and this is the first shot i've done and i'm just doing it to experiment to see if there are any of those crackling noises on the audio so that's all this is but i'm going off out for a walk now but i'm just going to listen to this first to see if i can film with confidence and know that there's not going to be any crackling noises on it well it's very rainy i just met the new neighbor she's just moved in well moving in with the help of my mum look at that we've had loads of rain i was awakened in the night by a very very loud downpour and the rain was practically horizontal beating against the window panes oh wow look at it reminds me of when we had storm dennis earlier in the year Goodness gracious me, that's the closest I get to looking at waves that is at the moment. Cut off from the sea I am during lockdown. Autumn is well and truly here, isn't it? Look at all these leaves, I think they've been washed up into a great big mound. <laughs> so, oh no, my umbrella's gone inside out. Oh, it's the worst time to go out for a walk. Ah, oh, well, this was the way I was intending to walk. I think these have got a bit of waterproofness in them. Let's see, shall we? Oh my goodness. Oh, I think I'm just going to put my foot in the water. It's quite shallow. So I tread on the plants. Oh no, that's really deep. <laughs> um, uh, no, I think actually that's going to go over the top of my shoes. Oh damn, okay, well, let's just think of another way to go then. <laughs> How annoying. Oh my gosh. Well, the last time I stood on this bridge here and looked at this river, there was barely any water in it. You could just see the bottom and a little meandering trickle a few feet across now is absolutely full. If I get back and look at the news and see there's been flooding again, I really won't be surprised. I'm gonna have a look at the other side as well. I am back. It is only 5.23 and it's really quite dark out there. I'm going to need to put this umbrella up so it can drip dry a bit. I'm going to get my wet stuff off now. I'm going to sit and edit for a bit. If you've enjoyed this video, do give it a thumbs up. It really helps the channel to grow. I so appreciate it. If you're new here and you would like to follow more of our story here in the firebreak lockdown in Wales and indeed the rest of our lives for as long as I keep vlogging, uh, feel free to hit the subscribe button and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.